Alright everyone, here we go! We're done with the Robot Masters, we got the beat part, so it's off to tackle Mr. X. Whose real identity is such a mystery. I'm sorry, I just can't get over how Capcom didn't even try. I mean, the thing with Kosak and Mega Man 4, that was plausible. Proto Man going bonkers in 5? Plausible, cause... But, Jesus Christ. They're insulting our freaking intelligence at this point. At least when they got to 9, doing 8-bit style games again. They tried to... They decide that if we're not gonna make it look like Wily at first, at least make it look plausible. Alright, will the windstorm fuck him up? Nope. Eh, fuck it. I'm not wasting the blizzard attack now. I will go ahead and use a tomahawk. Or the end of the game, getting it nitty gritty, some really nasty little obstacles now. And I don't want to use the top. Oh, oh! Oh, come on. I'll have plenty of time to refill the tomahawk before I get to the last boss. Should I. There's a trick to doing this, but I honestly don't remember what it is. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and try. Oh, that's right! I can just use that thing! What did I forget? I've done this before, but for the life of me, I can't remember what to do now. <sighs> oh, I got two hours, two minutes, thirty seconds. Oh, you know what? Fuck it. That's enough fail for one video. I was looking like hot shit, I got all the beat parts, got the energy bouncer. Ooh, I got life back, though. But I can't figure out that little puzzle. If you want to tell me in the comments how to do that, feel free, but right now, I'm not... I'm not bothering. I'm gonna have to use the tomahawk again. Oh, great! Falls down there where I can't get it. Thanks a lot! <coughs> Mint Chocolate Chip Klondike Ice Cream Bar. In case you were wondering. Fuck you, you... And fuck this shit. Screw you guys, I'm going up. Tomahawk again. <sighs> yeah, Tomahawk is a handy weapon. Remember AG AVGN reviews where he'd bitch about weapons like in Friday the 13th, The Rock, how it would arc over enemies? Well, this one kind of arcs down a little and curves up. Much more useful, wouldn't you say? Oh, man, I don't need... Well, I am gonna have to switch to the jet, so... Oh, I can't charge. You know, this is such a handy little tool. I don't even lament the lack of the regular rush jet. 
let's face it, that's kind of stuff being useful in Mega Man 3. I mean, after Mega Man 3, because Mega Man 3 can control wherever it went. I think afterwards it pretty much just went in a straight line, so yeah. Ah, great. Oh, well. Night Crush again. Actually, the music in this stage is pretty vanilla. I much prefer the one for the last castle. But I can't tell you whose castle it is, because it would be such a big spoiler. And sarcasm mode. Okay, fuck you, follow me around. Fuck this shit. I just drop this on him? No. I'll drop straight down. Oh well. Power. I don't know. What is there to talk about? Oh, I can't get more than nine. I should have used it then. Crap. Oh, well, at least that answers one burning question I had. Is there... what's down here? Oh, that's... if I had bothered with that puzzle, that's where I would have gone. And I think I could have gotten four extra lives there, which obviously I could have used. Okay, I think I used the Flame Blast up here. Yeah, that's doing it. Wasn't too hard. Okay. Seven minutes, thirty seconds. Not too bad. Not... Well, I might as well go on for the next stage. Don't break up the video. So, what else is there to talk about? Future plans for playthroughs. Well, actually, for my very first Let's Play, I was thinking of going back to that. Super Mario Bros. 2 hack, the My Little Pony one, but I decided no, not for my very first playthrough. Because I... I kind of want... Oh, shit, that's right. kind of wanted to rip on it for more, because it's just... It was just ridiculous. I covered it in the actual quick 10-minute video I did on it, but it was just still... Just so ridiculous, I had... I was just wanted to go back to it, but... No. Other things. I could, yes, I could do one of the original two Metal Gears. I still got the subsistence disc that has the originals on them. Okay, these are gonna drop on it, but I'm gonna. Just in case, just switch to the. Yep. Ah, I was expecting something to attack me. Ah, I was gonna need to switch to the jet anyway. <laughs> Funny how that works out. Okay, yeah. Gotta be careful. Yeah, to carelessly walk down this path would be to court death. Anyone else almost shit bricks when that last scene in Avengers played? I had absolutely no idea. I couldn't have even fathomed anyone using Thanos for a film. Then again, I didn't even imagine that Anyone would try using the alien symbiote in a Spider-Man movie, or Galactus in a Fantastic Four movie, and they happened. I, mean, I actually like Spider-Man 3. Come to think of it, I think I still like it a bit more than Amazing Spider-Man. But that's... talk about that another time. I'll probably do a review wrap-up of all the movies I've seen this year. 
Because there's some I didn't do quick reviews about. In fact, I did see Silent Hill Revelation last weekend. For those of you afraid it was going to take a nosedive like Mortal Kombat Annihilation, not so much. It was still an okay movie. Interesting retelling of Silent Hill 3, obviously. Ooh. Uh, remember what I said about the Silver Tomahawk being such a useful weapon because of the way it curves? It's pretty damn obvious that there were some bosses built around this damn weapon. One more. Okay, almost 11 minutes. That's gonna be it for now. Okay, just wait for a chance to pause it and then I'll sign off and start recording another video. And what part am I up to? Oh yeah, this is video 6, because doing the Robot Master is required an extra video. Alright, see you guys in a few minutes.